Hi everyone, it's Nalani and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to do a really, really quick unboxing of my December BoxyCharm box. I always do two videos with my BoxyCharm. I do an unboxing and then I do another video just testing out the products and giving you a mini little review and first impressions on the products that I'm receiving. So that will be the next video. Still a bit under the weather, so I'm not really in the mood to wearing makeup. I just want my skin to breathe. It's kind of just been a little rough. But as soon as you open it, I'm just adjusting that. So as soon as you open it, wait, there we go. Ooh, this is what it looks like. And it comes with a pamphlet that always lets you know the theme. So this month's theme is Whimsy right here and then on the back it lets you know all the products you're receiving as well as the value of it so if you guys are not aware boxycharm is now $25 a month and you get four to five full-size products so the first product is this right here this is the Stethica Pro Series brush cleanser and conditioner so this is it's obviously a makeup remover and I just want to see what brushes are good for. So it says it's a gentle cleanser and conditioner and suitable for both natural and synthetic brushes as well as makeup smudges. So that's actually really good. I am a huge fan of brush cleaners. I usually just typically use one thing to constantly wash my brushes, but I'm excited for that. I wash my brushes pretty much every time I use makeup. I just like clean brushes and I have acne prone skin so it's always good to keep your brushes clean. This retails you for $12. The next product is this right here. This is from LMS. This is the Pro Collagen Rose Facial Oil. It's soothing facial oil for fine lines and wrinkles. It has English Rose, Roaring Water Kelp, Soothes, Nourishes, and Smooths. So with this product, this was actually the product that I picked. What they are now doing as a feature is you get to pick one product that's guaranteed in your box. So I had a choice of this and the Saturday Skin Water Cream. Uh, in the winter time, my skin typically gets a bit drier, so I always like looking for a facial oil that's good for the winter time. And I did a little bit of research on this before picking it, and this just had a lot of really, really good reviews, and I love rose anything so this is the rose facial oil this is a bit pricier this is yes 79 dollars it's a really nice cute little packaging bottle and this smells like roses this smells absolutely amazing so i'm really excited to try this out my skin kind of needs this right now so i'm gonna try this out later and I'll let you guys know what I think about it. I do have to be really careful with oils. Some of them tend to break me out, but I found a couple here and there that have worked well for my skin, so I'm hoping that that's going to work really well. So the next product that I got right here is the palette. So it's be it was between this one and the green version. This is from Fairy's Hill Story Book Cosmetics. I've never tried any of their packaging any of their products but the packaging is really cute it just looks like a nice little book and this is what it looks like when you open it it's got six shades there and they're all so this is little red riding hood theme because the colors are red bad wolf bas basket peril journey and woods and this red looks beautiful for christmas time so i'm definitely going to be using the color in the look and this retails you for $35. Next product that I see here is this guy right here. This is a brow bar by Rima. It's a true brow brow makeover kit and this retails you for $30. I don't know the last time I used a brow kit. Okay, so this is a really pretty, luxurious looking packaging. This is in the shade Dark. Dark. And so you get two shades right here, and then this looks like a wax formula. And then right here is the brow gel. 
and you get a little brush right here that comes with it. I typically don't reach for the little brushes. The last brow kit do, trio was when Whitening Lightning, wait, is that a thing? Or the brow bar? I know they changed the name a couple of times. This is like 10 years ago. That was the last time I got anything like that. Oh, and this is a colored brow gel. So it's a really dark color. So I have to make sure that I don't get too heavy handed and carried away because I do tend to do that from time to time. But this actually looks really good. I have been liking a lot of powders lately. I typically just use my Anastasia, but I'm definitely going to try this out and see how it goes. And the last product I got right here is from Ciate. It's the Marble Light Illuminating Blusher. And I've really been into blushes lately, so I'm hoping this is going to be beautiful. This retails you for $26, and I know they have the three shades. The shade that I got is Burnt. And this is what it looks like. It just looks like a really nice, plummy, marbly tone. So I'm going to do a decent... Oh, so that's like pulling pink, pink. So this is what it looks like. It actually looks really, really pretty. And that's what it looks like blended out. And that was a decently heavy swatch. So I'm actually really excited. I So far I'm liking everything in the product just based off of what I see. In the next video I will test everything out. I'm gonna use everything in this box except obviously for the brush cleanser but I'll test that out that same night to clean all of my brushes and I'll let you guys know what I think. But I hope you guys enjoyed this really quick unboxing. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.